Hello. In this tutorial, I will show you how to use the mirror tool. Before you start, you should have a previous knowledge about the generalities of 3D and how to navigate the scene. For this, you can check my other tutorials on the webpage www.macrotutorials.com. The mirror tool helps us to create a new model that is an inverse image of the original object or just to invert the geometry of the selected object. Make it is pretty simple. Just select the object. This time, we have here this table set. Making a copy of it will be easier to see how the mirror tool works. Select it. And now move it to a new position. While you are pressing the key shift on the keyboard, appears the clone window. Select copy. And OK. And, in the main toolbar, we can find the mirrored button. This one. Click on it, and this window appears. Here you can select the axis for the mirroring. X is already selected into the scene. In the second table set, the geometry has now inverted, draw it the x-axis. C. Now, if we choose the y-axis, the table set changes. Now appears mirrored in other direction. Draw it the y-axis. And, selecting the z. The object turns upside down. And OK. To visualize it better, press Alt and X in the keyboard. C. But, we have more options. Just select the object. And click on mirror, and. The, the 10th Y option works to invert the geometry of the X and Y axis at the same time. And this is the YZ option. And this is the ZX option. Below it, you find this. By default, is enable no clone. But you can leave the original intact and only mirror a new copy. Just select the type of copy. A simple copy. An instance. Or a reference. And here you can offset the mirrored object. And to finalize, click OK. And is ready.